In this video we will continue with our hint to solve the max counter problem. In the previous video we have used the analogy of having this racetrack where we place our counter competing against each other. And when we get the max counter operation we move the starting line. The next part of that hint is what do we do when we get an increase for a counter that is behind the starting line. So let's see an example of when that happens when we get for example an increase of counter number one. Counter number one is behind the starting line. We move that particular counter to the front of our starting line. In effect adding one position after the starting line. So the trick here is to increment a counter normally if it is after the starting line or if it's behind the starting line move it to the starting line and increment by one. So we continue following those two rules with every single operation that we get in our input. Once we complete all our operation there is one final step that we need to perform but I will leave that final step to the solution video. So now go and try to implement this with your programming language and come back to see the solution and then later the implementation.